What's up guys, this is Timinator, and I'm back with episode 4 of Assassin's Creed. Um, when we left off we just finished Memory Block 2, so we're gonna head back into, uh, the real Welcome world machine, actually, and see what happens. What's the matter, Doc? Miss Stillman is once again insisting I let you rest. Okay, so I'm assuming we just have to go to our bed, so I'll actually just come back when we're back in the Animus, because this stuff is kind of lame. Okay, so it seems like there's not really much to do in this place besides at the beginning where it's kind of like introducing you to oh, everything. Worry, she'll be with us soon enough. So why are you doing all this, Doc? What are you hoping to accomplish? You turn the television on lately? Read the newspaper? Never cared much for that stuff. Then, let me sum it up for you. The world's a mess. It's pathetic, really. You've seen it firsthand yourself. A thousand years between you and your ancestor, and society remains just as barbaric, just as stupid. And your point is... Order, Mr. Miles. The world needs order. That is what we're working towards, and that is what you're helping us to achieve. <laughs> you expect me to believe you're building a better tomorrow? That's exactly what we're doing. The human race calls out for direction. They want to know why they're here. What they're meant to do, well, we're going to tell them. And once they understand how to live their lives, everything will be better. Better how? An end to all conflicts, large and small. Isn't that what you assassins strive for? Peace in all things? I told you, I'm not an assassin. Right, right. I still don't see where I fit into things. In time, Mr. Miles. In time, you'll understand. Or you won't. I don't care either way, as long as you show us where it is. Where what is? Sorry I'm late. Ready to go? Yes, we are. Damn it, I hate those cutscenes. They're so long. And I hate skipping them, though, because they could be important, but that one was kind of gay. I hate that dude. He's so boring. And he's just a complete dick, pretty much. Oh shit, what happened? There we go. It froze again. It did that when I woke up in the last episode. That was weird. Here we go, finally back into the Animus. Jeez, the cutscenes with that guy are so gay. I hate going back here. So, yeah, I'm gonna go back and do those at a later time. We might come back and do these at the end of the series. Like, if I ever miss any of these Let's modules... Go, Shut up, wasting. kid. God, I hate that guy. Um... But if we ever, if we, once we beat the game, I might come back to these memory blocks if we ever miss, like, any of the modules. Then we can just do that at the end of the series where we have, like, an episode or two where we just come back and 100% the game. I feel like that might be a good idea, but I'll try to get, like, all the synchronization points and stuff along the way. that this is but the first of many successes. Tamir spoke as if he knew you well. He implied my work had a larger meaning. Significance comes not from a single act, but the context within which it is performed. The consequence is born of it. Then is there more I need to know? Altair, your greatest failure was born of knowing too much. If I choose to withhold information, it is only to ensure you do not make the same mistake a second time. I see. No, you don't. And it will remain this way until you've learned your lesson. Still, you have performed competently. And as such, I restore a rank and will return a piece of your equipment. Go now, either to Akka or Jerusalem. There are men in both cities who require your attention. The bureau leaders can tell you more about what needs to be done. I really like that we have to go to like the different cities to find and assassinate each target. That I think that's pretty cool. Oh damn, he sticks the blade up? That's kind of weird. I'm surprised it wouldn't fall out. So we got short blade and counter kill. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go. Okay, so we got the counter kill back. So if I, rem I think I remember how to do that correctly. I'm not going to go to the training because that just kind of wastes time. I already kind of know how to use this stuff. Although, what is the short blade actually? I'm going to take that out a second and see. Oh, shit. This guy's going to talk to me again. Altair, it Shut up. My students do not fully understand All right, I'm going to have to do this training quick. Blade. I'll be right back. 
Okay, so we are back once again, and we are leaving the kingdom again, I assume. So he said we can go to Jerusalem or a different place. I forgot what the other place was, but I'm thinking we'll just go to whatever the closest one is. There's only one mountain showing up, and it seems like that um, number at the like towards the middle of the map actually might be counting down how many meters away I am from that thing. So, I'm gonna get to this city, and then we're gonna start doing some exploring and try to assassinate this guy. Okay, so it looks like we made it to the kingdom. And... I think our kingdom is called Masayav, I think. I think that's actually what it's called. Um... I think... What am I supposed to do here? Where's my target? To Ek here. To Jerusalem. Okay. Speak with Bureau Leader and Acker and Jerusalem. Okay, so this is just kind of an in-between place. So I'm probably going to collect all these viewpoints right now. And I'll see you guys in... Probably Jerusalem is the one I'm going to go to first. So I'll see you guys in Jerusalem. Oh, snap, guys. We got ourselves in a situation. I was trying to take down some Templars, because I'm pretty sure there's a mission that you have to take down a bunch of Templars. But we are- Oh shit, oh shit. Stop, 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 stop. I'm in combat, so I can't freaking run. Bang! Let's go, okay. I just gotta single him out like this. Since I got my counterattack, I thought I might be able to do this. But it's actually- I keep messing up- Damn, I just broke his arm pretty hard. Oh, they keep, like, pushing me and stuff, though. And they can, like, actually counter your attacks, too. The Templars can. And I keep messing it up like that. You have to, like, time it perfectly. Bang! Let's go. Dude, he just breaks his arm. That's cruel. What the fuck, dude? I'm actually gonna lose to the last two guys. This is... Oh my gosh, dude! Are you kidding me? What the heck, bro? That's so dumb. Oh my gosh, guys, we got ourselves in the same situation. I got to this freaking viewpoint. Holy crap, that camera angle, though. <laughs> um, I got myself to this viewpoint, and all of a sudden, these dudes started attacking me because I attacked some of their friends, and apparently, they were close enough to start attacking me. Why do you punch them? That happened three times already, where he just counters and punches. There we go. Bang. Let's go. Okay, there's two more. This time, I should be able to do this. I got full health, too, so I'm feeling pretty confident. And my counters are more on point now. I think that was my problem the last time. I couldn't get my counters. Okay, this guy I should just be able to take. <laughs> One slice. Okay. Let's go. Okay. I'm going to carry on with these viewpoints. Okay, we're just synchronizing the last point now. And that actually took a lot longer than I thought it would. It was actually kind of ridiculous, and I'll show you why in a second. Hopefully it doesn't do the same thing right now. Please, 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 please. Oh my god. Okay, that's one of the reasons why. Is because every time I freaking jump off of those things, it actually kills me for some reason. It's so stupid. I don't know why. I reloaded my game, and it worked for a few more points. And then it started doing it again for these last two. So, I'm just gonna scale it down, I guess. Um, that's what I did the last time, because I don't want to reload my game again, because that's kind of annoying. Zero of six investigations complete. Two investigations are needed to access an assassination memory. Climb a viewpoint to locate them. Okay. So, I have to actually complete viewpoints to actually get this. To actually get the unlock the assassination target. Holy crap. Okay, I think we're gonna do this first viewpoint together, because I really kind of do all the viewpoints off camera. But we might do these two together because these two are required for part of the story. So, we're just going to do whatever the two closest ones are, though. Oh, shit. <laughs> My bad. Okay, I need to blend in with some scholars to get in, I'm pretty sure. Or I might just be able to kill all these guys in no count, too. Why the fuck did you... What the fuck are you doing, horse? Jeez. Look at all the guys I killed. That's, like, I've been killing that many guys at a time for a while now. I don't know why I can't go in here. Do I have to just get off the horse? Or can I legit not go in here without scholars? Oh, yeah, I have to get off the horse, Rip. Okay. Okay, so these guys aren't actually hostile. 
Even though they have the Templar symbol on them, which is kind of weird. Can I get up here? Oh, yes, I can. Sweet. Okay. And I messed up, of course. Oh, that's actually a small synchronization point. Holy crap. Is that gonna, guy gonna attack me? Oh, shit. I think he might. Oh, rip. <laughs> now those guys just saw him. They're probably gonna come after me, rip. Yeah, this is a small synchronization point. Jeez. Hopefully they don't knock me off, because they actually throw... Yep, they're throwing stones at me. They actually throw stones at you, and they can... Oh, my God. This is cancer. They can actually knock you off with those stones, which is super annoying. Brother's whining in the fucking background of my video. That kind of pisses me off. Dang, a 1 of 11 viewpoints scaled. Oh, this is in a different area. I forgot. Okay. Holy crap, that just opened up all the viewpoints. <laughs> I honestly don't know if I should do these right now. But I don't know if I'm going to come back to these areas anytime soon. Oh, crap. There's a citizen to save over there. Eavesdropping. Ooh. I think that's closer, so we're going to do that. Okay, where is this? Oh, yeah, it's literally, like, right here. <laughs> okay, let's do this quick. Who do I have to eavesdrop on? Okay, I have to find a bench. There's a bench. And let's lock onto these dudes. You hear about Elaine? The archer who guards the eastern wing? Poor bastard's brother caught an arrow in the throat. Doubt he'll last the night. How can he continue to work knowing what's to come? He visits his brother often, so I cover for him when I can. You aren't there now? No. I family business of my own to attend to. Then he'd best hope the doctor doesn't learn of his desertion. He won't. Long as you stay silent. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. Okay, there's some fortress roof guards absent from patrol duty. Okay, that actually counted as one of those modules. That's pretty interesting. Um, I honestly kind of want to just do all these to get them over with so I don't have to keep running around trying to find these later on. So I'm going to do all of these synchronization points right now. And I'll come back to you guys when we're ready to assassinate the dude. Okay, I just received this uh, challenge from this guy. I remember I did one speed challenge recently. Come back to me when you have finished. But he wants me to assassinate some guys. Or a guy, I think. Yeah, we gotta assassinate a guy. Um because he doesn't think it's safe on the streets for him. So we're gonna go assassinate this guy and see what happens when we do this. Oh snap. Is that him? That might be him actually. Shit. Oh, uh, how did he not see me, bro? That is actually, like, crazy how he didn't see me. Apparently these guys are blind. Okay. I'm so getting the hang of the, um, the, what's it called? The counterattack, though. It's so good, too. What the heck? Stealth assassinate all targets? What the heck? There's more? Where's the other ones? Oh, maybe I have to kill this one. Maybe there was more after that that I had to kill. Okay, that's interesting. We're gonna take him out. Yes, let's go. All it says all targets have been assassinated. So why didn't it... I reported to him. That's what I don't get. I did kill the target. It was only one target. I don't know why it didn't work. Let's see. It is done. There we go. I don't know why it didn't work the last time. Maybe the guys technically saw me before I killed him. Maybe that's why. I'm guessing that's it. Garni let his patients roam the halls of his fortress. No one, save scholars, may enter his personal workspace and the rooftops are guarded by archers. I'm sure this information will help deliver Garni to the gates of hell. Okay, snap. None may enter the fortress save for scholars and guards. Okay, so yep, I was right. That gave me a memory block. Okay. 
I'm just gonna have to, like, kind of look up eventually. Return to the Bureau to begin your assassination memory. You may also continue to do more investigations if you wish. Okay, so that counted as an investigation. That's pretty cool. Um, but I'm still gonna do all these things around here. Um, I'm planning to put together a little time lapse of all the viewpoints being synchronized. I don't know. I just kind of like doing little time lapses here and there. But, um, I'm gonna get back to that now. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I think I, I think this is like when I had to interrogate that one guy before. Because it says it's an interrogation target, so I'm guessing I have to follow him like I did with that one guy. And then attack him in like an alley or something where I can interrogate him. So I'm gonna follow this guy into an alley. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. I don't know where the heck he's going, so I'm just gonna keep following him. This camera angle is kind of annoying though, but it helps me keep an eye on where he is. So I'm just going to keep it like this for now. Okay, he's actually going this way. See, that's why I kind of want this camera angle, so I can actually tell where he's going. Because it's kind of hard to follow him at the same time, so... Ooh, that was close. He might have actually seen me there for a second. Yeah, I think he did. Can I synchronize again? Can I lock on? I don't know if I can. Yep, there we go. Sweet. Oh, crap, that was close. I might actually be able to take him out here right now. I don't know if I want to, I don't know if I can actually, like, kill him, though. What is the thing to switch to your fists? Is it four? Yeah, it's four. Okay. So, we're, I think we're just going to have to beat him to death, pretty much. Or, not to death, but beat him until he talks. There we go. Mercy, mercy. Don't kill me. I'll do anything you want. You serve Gagne? He, he makes me say these things to keep the people from revolting, to give them hope and make them eager for his touch. Tell me everything you can about the man. Y yes, of course. I, I know what happens within, what he really does. Go on. Not sick, not wounded when they enter, but once he's got his hands on them, then the pain begins. He's no healer then. Just a sick, cruel man. I, I don't know what it is he does to make them cry so loud, but it must be stopped before more are made to suffer. Will you stop him? It's why you still live. He is cautious. You must pick the proper time. Go to him when he attends to the patients. He forgets the world around him, becomes lost in his work. Yes, strike then. I thank you for the information. Then you'll let me go? Would that I could. Oh, snap. Okay. So we just straight up killed that guy. Okay. Well, apparently we got some information out of that guy. So apparently those, like, those more rare, I guess you could say, those more rare, um, like in the interrogation, the assassinate thing, those more rare things that you find that are just, like, little mini missions or side missions... Those give you a whole module by itself, but whereas these viewpoints, you actually have to collect all of them in the city to actually get a module, same with the citizens. So, anyways, let's carry on. To speak of, just some damn tube. All I found was a bit of paper with these nonsense scratchings. Them's not nonsense, but words and letters. Why is a man putting words and letters in a tube? The way a tube, if you ask me. Must be important. Give it here, and I'll have a look. Like you helped last time. I ain't letting you steal this. Well, I ain't you. Clever. Have fun with it, then. Okay. Now we're going on to a pickpocket mission. Kind of interesting. Oh, shit. He saw me. <laughs> Rip. It actually didn't have to do the cutscene. That's kind of cool. Oh, shit. Okay, he's looking around before he starts walking. Okay, now he's walking. How? I thought he was so gonna see me. Okay. Let's go. Look at those modules piling up. We just got four more regular ones to go, and then the two blue ones at the end, I think, are always the viewpoints and the citizens. So, yeah. Let's carry on. 
Okay, I know I'm recording a lot of these extra things, but I found another um of these timed challenges, so we're gonna try this out. I might cut this out of the video, but I might not. It depends on how long the video gets, because I don't want it to be longer than a half an hour, but I think what I'm gonna start doing is... I'm gonna start um recording um one of the assassination targets per video. I'm, I was going to say memory block, but technically in this memory block, there's two assassination targets that I have to kill. So I'm going to do one assassination target eat. Find, find and collect 20 Massey up flags. What? Oh my gosh, this is gay. What am I? Where are the? Oh, that's a flag. Oh my gosh, I'm stupid. Okay, that's a flag up there. Can I get up there? Yes, I can. Okay. So I have to collect all these flags. I'm guessing I just have to keep going on like a parkour like run pretty much like in a certain direction shit dude the camera was so bad there okay here's the next one yeah i think i just have to keep following these things yep it looks like it okay this isn't actually as hard as i thought it would be i thought i would have to find them like literally search for them in a certain amount of time i was gonna say that would be pretty gay but this isn't actually that bad i don't think i might fail this first time because i messed up quite a few times but hopefully it's not gonna take that long hopefully i can first try this this isn't too hard. Oh, crap. I messed that one up big time. Oh, my God, dude. I still feel like there's a lot of room for mess-ups in this, though. Oh, my shit, dude. Why? I just went through that. Okay, okay. I literally went through that beam. Okay. I already have, like, I don't know, over half of them, actually. So, we're doing okay. We haven't even gone through half the time. We got this. Easy, easy. Yeah, like, this isn't even hard. I'm messing up so- What the fuck, dude? I'll tell you, he's stupid sometimes. Like, legit, he'll just fall off the, like, easiest things to grab onto. Like, come on, really? But this is actually super easy. I might have to get back to the guy in time, too, but that's still gonna be super easy. Okay, let's just time this- Why does he jump as soon as I hold right-click? That's dumb. There we go. Okay, I should definitely have this. Yeah, I got this. This is the second last one, I think. Yeah. Why, dude? It's so annoying jumping on these things. Like, seriously. All flags have been collected. And we can return to this, dude. Easy. I'm impressed. Not enough to change my mind about you. But since Al Muelim commands, here is what I know about your next target. Garnier hides in the Hospitalier Fortress. Getting into the fortress will require cunning. That's all I have for you. Okay, so basically all these investigation targets are just giving me advice on how to get Garnier. Or how to find him, actually. But I only have to complete two of those, technically, and then I can go to the Biru, so it doesn't really matter. But I'm gonna keep going with these uh, synchronization targets now. Okay, I just finished uh, another mission. I had to stealth assassinate two archers. Um, pretty easy, not too bad. But I'm, I think I'm gonna start. If I find any more of these, I'm just gonna start like skipping ahead or like come back when I finish them, just to let you guys know that I completed them. But look at that, six of the modules are completed. So I actually am thinking of going for a completionist playthrough. The only thing is that to do that, I think. I would need to collect these, like, certain flags and stuff. There's a lot of stuff to collect. I'm gonna have to look it up and look look up, like, how, like, how many things you actually have to collect if you want to do a completionist playthrough. But I'm actually thinking of doing that. And I'm guessing, like, for me, I'm thinking the flags and stuff, like, if I do actually have to collect a ton of things, um, then I'm gonna come back and do those, uh, later on. But for now, what I'm thinking is I'm just going to do the main DNA modules in the regular playthrough and then come back to those at the end and then do the other stuff later on. But I'm going to continue on with these viewpoints because I'm almost at another one.
Okay, and it looks like that was actually the last of the viewpoints. So we now have gotten all of Acre completed. Now we just have to save these last three citizens, and then we can go to the Biru. So I'm going to finish up these last citizens. Bam! Let's go. And here we are at the last citizen we have to save. Let's do this. Okay, so now I have actually synchronized all the points, and I've also saved all the citizens. So if she could stop talking, that would be great. Good, good. So we're just missing two of the modules, but that's not too bad. We can come back to that later. Honestly, you just kind of find them along the way. So let's head to the Biru now. Okay, it looks like we're coming up to the Biru now. So, we're gonna just head in here and talk to the dude. Ah, Altair. A little bird told me you'd be paying a visit. Al Muallam has ordered the execution of Gagne de Naplus. The Grand Master of the Knights Hospitalier? Indeed. And I have already determined when and how to strike. Share your knowledge with me then. He lives and works within the Order's Hospital, northwest of here. Rumors speak of atrocities committed within its walls. It seems the good doctor enjoys experimenting on innocent citizens. Most of them kidnapped and brought here from Jerusalem. Clever. By stealing his subjects from another city, he avoids arousing too much suspicion here. But back to the matter at hand. What is your plan? Gagne keeps mainly to his quarters inside the hospital, though he leaves occasionally to inspect his patients. It's when he makes his rounds that I will strike. It's clear you've given this some thought. I give you leave to go. Okay. Um. My dudes. Okay, there we go. That was weird. I guess I might have just had to walk into it to take it. I'm not sure. Perhaps it will help cleanse your own. Rest here until you're ready to begin your mission. Okay, so basically we're just collecting all the feathers and getting their blood from it. Okay, that's interesting. Interesting thing to collect, I guess. Strike Garnier while he is atten while he is tending his patients. Okay. Oh snap, that gave me one of the DNA modules. I'm guessing the last one is when we assassinate him. Okay, that's actually really cool. Um Biru assassination target. Okay, I actually came in this place before, not knowing what this place no, was, but help, apparently this is the assassination me. target. Help me, oh, please. shit. You must help me. Dang. Dang, they're, everybody's just watching. Else I cannot help you. Help me? Like you helped the others? You took their souls. I saw. I saw. But not mine. No. You'll not have mine! Ah! Take hold of yourself! Do you think this gives me pleasure? Do you think I want to hurt you? But you leave me no choice. Every kind word matched by the back of his hand! All lies and deception! He won't be content until all bow before him! You should not have done that. Return him to his quarters. I'll be along once I've tended to the You can't other. keep me here. I'll escape again. No, you won't. Break his legs, both of them. Have you people nothing better to do? Okay, wait, so where did our assassination target go? I don't know where he went. Is he... Did he go around this way? He might have. Why is it all blurry? What the heck? Is it supposed to be like that? I don't know why it's so blurry. Is he up here? Okay, for some reason these guys are literally just letting us walk in here. Easy. Let go your burden. Ah, I'll rest now, yes. The endless dream calls to me. But before I close my eyes, I must know 
What will become of my children? You mean the people made to suffer your cruel experiments? They'll be free now to return to their homes. Homes? What homes? The sewers? The portals? The prisons that we dragged them from? You took these people against their will. Yes. What little will there was for them to have. Are you really so naive? Do you appease a kind child simply because he wills? But I want to play with fire, father. What would you say? As you wish. Ah. But then you'd answer for his burn. These are not children, but men and women full grown. In body, perhaps, but not in mind. Which is the very damage I sought to repair. I admit, without the peace of Eden, which you stole from us, my progress was slowed. But there are herbs, mixtures, and extracts. My guards are proof of this. They were madmen before I found and freed them from the prisons of their own minds. <sighs> and with my death, madmen they will be again. You truly believe you were helping them? It's not what I believe. It's what I know. Okay, now we have to get rid of these guys. Um, and then return to the Biru, and then I think we're good. So, we're just gonna do this quick. Hopefully it won't take too long. I'm getting so, so much better at the, um... Oh, snap, I think they're running. Ha! Rip. Okay, I'm going after this guy. Oh, rip, now these guys saw me. <laughs> Lol. Nope, you're not getting away today. My dude. There we go. Okay, now I think they're all gone. Okay, run. I don't know why it's so blurry in this place. I think it's supposed to be like that, but I don't know why. Doesn't really make sense. Oh my gosh, get out of my way. Jeez, these people are such idiots. Okay, I'm going to head back to the Biru, and I'll meet you guys back there. Okay, we made it back to the Biru again. And I think we're going to be ending this uh, this set of DNA modules. Or this assassination target. Then you should return to Masayat with news of your victory. There is something else. Speak it then, or would you have me read your mind? What do you think he wanted from these people? That he would keep them and experiment on them as he did? Yours is not to ask, but act, Altair. It doesn't matter what he did or why. Only that he's dead. But Gagne seemed to believe he was helping these people. Is that what you saw? No. What I saw was not a place of healing, but of pain. Then why are we having this conversation? I... I don't know. Forget I spoke of it. I already have. Fast oh my gosh, the cutscenes in this game are so dumb. They're so boring. They're literally just people talking every single time. It's so stupid. Wow, look at that. We got all the DNA modules for this one. A. Hey. Oh, sweet, we can just go right back there. It's cool that we don't have to travel all the way back from here. That would be kind of a pain. Have you news for me, Altair? Gagne de Naplus is dead. Excellent. We could not have hoped for a more agreeable outcome. And yet... What is it? The doctor insisted his work was noble. And looking back, those who were supposedly his captives seem grateful to the man. Not all of them, but enough to make me wonder. How did he manage to turn enemy into friend? Leaders will always find ways to make others obey them. And that is what makes them leaders. When words fail, they turn to coin. When that won't do, they resort to baser things. Bribes, threats, and other types of trickery. There are plants, Altair. Herbs from distant lands that can cause a man to take leave of his senses. So great are the pleasures it brings, that men may even become enslaved by it. You think these men were drugged then? Poisoned? Yes, if it truly was as you describe it. Herbs. 
This seems a strange method of control. Our enemies have accused me of the same. The promise of paradise. They think it is a garden, overflowing with women and pleasure. But I drug you as Garnier did his men, and tempt you with his rewards. They do not know the truth of it. Which is how it must be. But if they knew the truth of it, that all we seek is peace, then they would not fear us, and we would have no hold over them. Go. It is time you continued with your work. Another rank is restored to you, as is a piece of your equipment. We'll speak again when the next has fallen. Okay, finally. Okay, what do we get back now? I was, like, hardly paying attention to that cutscene. Do we get anything back? Uh, oh, yes, we got throwing knives back. Okay, sweet. And tackle? Is that the throwing thing? I think it is, actually. I don't, actually, I don't think it is. I would think it would say tackle. But, um, that's gonna do it for this episode. Um, next time we will be going to Jerusalem to take on the next guy. I don't remember who it is. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in episode 5.